toddlers at this age love putting small pieces into small holes. This is why they love this pegboard. Research shows too that playing with pegboards early actually helps build spatial relationships and math skills. So like every other Montessori material, there usually is some kind of progression. Initially, your child will just need to practice taking the pegs off. So if you fill up the board for them, then you can invite your child to take the pegs off and they'll enjoy just that experience and putting them back in the basket. Then they will be ready in time to build perhaps a tower or perhaps they want to start by just putting things in on a flat level. Really follow their lead. I wouldn't over teach this. Let them sort of maybe even accidentally discover maybe through their own play of putting it together to recognize, oh, wait a minute, I can go higher and kind of let them unpack that on their own. They'll have a lot of uh, fun with that. Over time, you might find that they will be building pretty big towers. And this is really a great opportunity to start to bring in some vocabulary that you could say, look at this tower is taller than this tower. Or you could say this tower has more pegs and this one has less pegs. It's also fun, so like you can do this with snacks, but it's really fun to do it also with these pegs to say, to, your, to give all of the pegs to your toddler and say, you have all of the pegs. I don't have any pegs. Can I have some of the pegs, please? And see if your toddler will give you some. You can even try saying, can I have one peg, please? And see if your toddler will give you one. And you can play the game two, three, and give them back to your toddler. It's fun.